now we have reached the referee the for this match will be Tim Cooper. The moment we've all been waiting for. is for the Rally Invasion Pro Championship. The Heavyweight Championship here, First, Rally Invasion Pro Wrestling. The challenger. Weighing in tonight at 210 pounds from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, Zach Prime Time Reed. So here he comes, the man, the myth, the legend, Zach Prime Time Reed held countless championships here in California. A well-traveled veteran in the ring, near 20 years of experience here. This is going to be a hell of a test to see what kind of a champion J.J. King is. In J.J. King's first title defense, he has maybe one of the greatest professional wrestlers to grace any ring here in California. Anywhere. Anywhere on the map for that matter. This man has proven his worth time and time again. What he can do and prove how damn good he is. It doesn't matter the ego, it doesn't matter the change of heart. You have to respect what Zach Primetime Reed has done for professional wrestling as a whole. Has done in any ring, you look at his credentials, you see the track record. He's going to take his time getting this ring. This is going to be a hell of a moment. He's looking for one more title to put around his waist. He's looking for one more accolade. And that one more accolade is here in Reading, California with the Reading Invasion Pro Wrestling Heavyweight Championship. Tell you fans, I have been waiting for this match since we made the announcement. I have been and excited. introducing the champion. Playing in tonight at 215 pounds. He is from the kingdom. Ladies and gentlemen, this place just came alive. It is electric here in the Elf Lodge. This crowd is on their feet, alive for J.J. King, the Reading Invasion Pro Wrestling Heavyweight Champion. He has proven his work here and has a hell of a test. He is a mountain to climb against Zach Blindtime Reef. Can he do it with these people solely in his corner? He's carrying the weight of Reading Invasion Pro on his back right now. Will he crumble or will he rise to the occasion? JJ King makes his way around this ring. What a fantastic, a fantastic ovation for this man who has truly deserved every bit of this in his hometown. All business is being sued men right now. I don't know if in the career of JJ King he's faced a lot of tough opponents. He's faced the best to have to offer anything that's been stacked against that he's met head on. I don't know if he's met a challenge quite like this on a stage that we're presented right now in the Elks Lodge for the highest championship we have to offer here. Reading Invasion for Wrestling Heavyweight Championship against Zach Grindtime Reed. <laughs> Our senior official, Tim Cooper, gonna call this one. Move. I am joined now. Oh, what a pleasure it is. 
I'm sure it is, since you uh, basically tried to just screw me out of my number one contenders match. Oh, I tried to destroy you. Yeah. By trying to make sure that things are fair, because Little Miss You-Know-Who behind us likes to stack the back in your favor. I don't know what you're talking about, Mr. General Manager. All right. I win all my matches all by myself, just like I'm going to be the next... Reading Invasion Pro Champion. It doesn't matter if it's JJ King or Zach Reed. Uh, well, we'll see about that. JJ King pandering to these idiots here in Reading. I, there's only a, another group of bigger idiots in California than in Reading, and that's the people of Oroville. Well, it seems everywhere you go in, there's an equal amount of hatred when you walk into a room, and now I'm starting to understand it as we get this match kicked off between J.J. King and Zach Primetime Reed. Neither one of these men are gonna try to rush into this. I would assume you're pulling for uh, JJ King since you just hate anybody that uh, likes to bend the rules a little bit. Well, actually, to tell you the truth, uh, rules are meant to be broken, but when it comes to someone putting themselves into a match when they clearly do not belong there, I'm not going to stand for it. And sir, I'm not on the side of anybody. I hold no bias to any wrestler in this company. I actually am on the side of Reading Invasion Pro being the best it can be. And whoever is on that top of the mountain, as long as they're holding that championship with pride and doing the best to try to make this company better, that's what I'm on the side of. Okay, well, I mean, great arm drag from Zach Reed. Nobody does it better. Mm. I do have to uh, commend you. You did, uh, you did hire me, so. You know, I'm never going to deny the talent that you bring to the table, Shoop. I've never, never once denied that or tried to talk less about you. I know what you can do. It just is a... Oh, oh. As JJ's playing a little mind games here, it's just a little disheartening to see you have to stoop to such tactics because you're so insecure about what you may not have in that ring Speaking instead of, of being focused on what you can do. Speaking of insecure... Why do you think JJ chose to wear pink today? I mean, that's... Well, it's uh, the real men wear pink. Isn't that what they say? Isn't that how the saying goes? Well, you know, Canadians own Bret Hart. Does that sting you a little bit? With an American wearing the uh, pink and black? No, I prefer uh, red and white. And uh, JJ looks like he's got a pretty good headlock. But Zach Reed, being the athlete that he is, is back to his feet. Nice leapfrog over. Another leapfrog over. They're going for that boot. Oh, escaping the kick there. Into a scoop slam. Oh, and right there, the right there, Spencer is why. MPT is one of the best. Yeah, I will not doubt that. I will never. He deny just that. outsmarted your champion. He is one of the most clever, one of the most gifted and talented athletes that ever graced foot in any ring in California. Might I say anywhere? Well, you would be correct. I will take nothing away from the talent that Zachary brings to the ring. This is, to date, the biggest challenge in JJ King's career. Incredible chop. Nice shots in the corner. Zach Reed's got this one in control. Mm. What's the and you know doing? that and you know Zach Reed's gonna take full control of that four count, as he should. Use that roll book to your advantage. As far as I see, there's nothing wrong. Yeah, that, that referee Tim Cooper, he likes he likes to get in uh, our business in that ring. He should just back off and just let things happen. Steve Walsh is a pretty fair official as far as I've seen. That's why he is our senior official here. And nice suplex, JJ King. 
going for a quick cover, one count. A lot of people don't understand why they hit these quick covers after moves, but you don't understand how how much it takes out of your opponent. You might understand how much it takes out of your opponent when you pin those shoulders to the mat, how much they have to exert of their energy to push you off. Oh! And, and that's the thing. Everybody, they, they see uh, all these flippy moves up. They see all these flippy moves nowadays, all these high, flashy moves. Everybody, they, they just take for granted a, a simple suplex or a simple backdrop. It, it just knocks the wind out of you. And a match could end at any moment. I can't disagree with you. I'm, I'm, just, uh, I'm assuming, ooh, big knee drop there. Assuming you're not a fan of the dive. No. Man wasn't meant to fly, Spencer. Zach Reeve gets a two count there on JJ King, wearing him down. As I've uh, noticed your anti-cruiserweight moniker that you're now rocking, and, and to your credit, you are one hell of a technician in the ring. And flying is not, oh! Ooh! Caught all those ropes, King was. Those ropes aren't barely loose either. Oh, no, people don't understand how rough those ropes are. You think this is all cake and all butter in this ring, it is not. Oh, backdrop right there on the apron. That, that is the hardest good. spot in the ring, Spencer. Oh. Of course, you wouldn't know that, Mr. Talk, Talk, Talk. Okay. See, we're pulling no punches here now. Oh! Oh! Right on the tail, though. Right. That, that could have been it for J JJ. could be paralyzed. That's going to really affect the rest of this match. I don't know if JJ King's going to be able to come back from that. There's a harsh, harsh drop right on the tailbone. Outside on that apron. Zach Reed, the wherewithal, the ring veteran that he is, rolling in to break the count. Going to take that time. Really going to put, put that hurt on JJ on the outside. Oh, he's going for a suplex. Thinking about going for a suplex on the up. Oh! Suplex on the floor here, ladies and gentlemen. That, that is a hardwood worse. floor. This does not feel nice. That's even worse than the apron. There's nothing, yeah, there's nothing forgiving huh. about that hardwood floor. That is, both men right now, as far as we can see, are a little bit averted, but I cannot see either men making a lot of movement on that outside. Yeah, apparently uh, our monitors seem to be missing tonight at a Reading Rebellion. Well, you know what? Like I said before to the booties, uh, booties of destruction, it did take a lot out of our cash purse to get Voice the Grand here tonight. But regardless, incredible, incredible matchups we got here tonight. JJ King taking advantage and sent Zach Reeb into that ring post there. I'm shocked. Trying to get back in control. Oh, hung up there on the top for a second. Oh, and Zach Reeb's going to take it. Oh! Seems like JJ King had a foot slip there and caught himself. But Out Zach Reed JJ King. with the ring savvy, that veteran, a veteran instinct to get in there immediately. You make a mistake around Zach and a two count. You make a mistake around Zach Reed, it could be your last mistake. Very true. Didn't believe it. He went for another two count there. Like I said, that it takes so much out of your opponent to try to put, try to get your shoulders off the mat and push your opponent off. This could be it. JJ's back's been taking a beating. Oh! oh Again on those rope. tight ropes. Those ropes are not loose. Look at the methodical pace of MPT. Just taking his time. Picking apart JJ King. Oh, what's he got planned here from the top? Oh! Oh! That back is taking an absolute beating here, ladies and gentlemen. Elbow drop while he's draped across the ropes. This is gonna be over before we know it. And, and, oh, just a two count. If I'm not mistaken, Reading Invasion uses elevator cable underneath that. It's not forgiving. It's not. It's not forgiving. To tell you the truth, I came in here and tried to run those ropes myself. Yeah, how that still a little bit winded in pain. Yeah. It could be the American in there. Oh, is that it? It, it could be. Quite possible. These stupid American idiots need to be quiet and let Zach Reed work. It's very distracting. You do understand that he's from America as well. I know, but 
Has yeah, you made him an honorary Canadian? Is that stepping in it? I just, I just can appreciate hmm. someone that doesn't listen to these simple-minded idiots. And Zach Reed is one of those people. He's been doing this a long time, and he just knows what it takes to win. Putting those shoulders down, do that extra work. I'm now you've got to start to wonder the, the, the amount of punishment that J.J. King has taken to his back. I'm not sure if he's going to be able to, to rise above this. What is it going to take for him to get past that experience? This is this is where Zach is comfortable. Oh, and now he's got there. Quick DDT. Try to, try to put himself back in the driver's seat. Well, you know, J.J. won that title in a fatal four-way match where Zach almost, he almost had the win. That is a fact. This is one-on-one -on -one against a fresh Zach Reed. And that's why we made this matchup shoot. That is exactly why we brought this to the table, because we saw how close it was. Going for that sick kick. Oh! Knocking the sick kick, great reversal, and onto that back again. Catapult there into the corner. That's steel under that very thin pad. Oh! Super kick, that's it. Oh. Oh, and J.J. King to the outside. So Primetime's going to want to get him back in the ring. He's wasting no time trying to get him in there. Oh! oh. I don't know how J.J. had the wherewithal to get up to get that knee. I, I'm shocked. Oh, hanging DDT from that middle rope. That, that super kick that Zach hit him with has I'm, put, put down many, many. He has won matches. countless matches and, might I say, titles with that super kick. Oh, you got to think if J.J. King might have hooked a leg there, that might have been a three count. Could have been. You're not going to get a win on Zach Reed by not hooking a leg. Correct. Takes, takes a lot to put that man down. Oh, now we're going to trade shots in here. We're going to trade forearms. Trash talking by JJ. Well, he's never been uh, one to shy away from letting somebody know exactly what he thinks. And now it's an uppercut, uppercut, multiple uppercuts there from Zach Reed. Oh, oh, super European uppercut out of nowhere. Incredible. Oh, he's on his feet. He's an athlete. He is, there he is on the top rope. Okay, coming under that. Prime time looking. Oh, ho, ho. wow, JJ King outsmarting the veteran there for a set. It's that backdrop. Both men are down in the ring. Hell of a match that we've seen so far as JJ is going for that cover. Giving it about all the, oh, so close. Giving it about everything he can just to drape an arm over. JJ almost made a liar out of me, not hooking the leg, almost got the three. I would have been just as shocked as you were. But it doesn't matter because the next Reading event, I'm going to take the title no matter who it is. This is this is all just a formality. Is it now? It is. You're that confident in yourself. Of course, you have to be. And your and your singular abilities as a singles competitor with nobody else involved. I, I do. Ev I win every match I've ever won. Has been all by myself. Really. 100 percent of the time. Hmm. That is. That is news to me. You should you should take a look. You should watch my match instead of throwing my managers out. As far as I'm concerned, uh, Kimmy got harder shots in on Chico than you did. Oh, that's cute. Big trade blows. Those are not light yeah. shots coming from Zach Reed. If I'm not mistaken, you've been on the receiving end of a couple of those. And shoot, those aren't nice to deal with. No, Zach Reed, after having a match with Zach Reed. Oh, no. the counter. Oh, and a quick roll through. He didn't even, he didn't get all, oh no, school by roll up. Oh. oh. He caught the better. He caught him. That fast. That fast. And JJ King was incredible. No winner of your match. So that's my opponent. And still, 
now we have so our next event. We now have our main event set. It will be JJ King defending his Reading Invasion Pro Wrestling Heavyweight Championship against, well, me. You, Shellhammer. You gotta go in there. If JJ thought that was tough, he has no idea what he just got himself into. No matter the feelings, sir, I know your abilities. I know what you bring to the ring. I will be looking forward to seeing your match against JJ King for the title. Kimmy, it looks like you've started a fan club over here. Yeah. Those stupid little American boys, they don't know. Oh, well, they, they don't know the caliber. Hey, everyone's gonna have an opinion there. Oh, his best friendly Perfetto is laughing. The history between JJ and Lee Perfetto. The history there. Zach Reed giving his deal. Look at that history. Ladies and gentlemen, these two guys have traveled around. Great friends. Well, I, I gotta get a closer look real quick, Spencer. Mike, uh, shoot, Shellhammer's leaving my table here. I'm gonna get a little closer look here. JJ King, I guess, measure his opponent for the next show. Oh! What? What the, what the hell is going on? Lee! Lee, Lee! These guys were friends! These guys were best friends! JJ! JJ! How are you? How are you, friends? Don't, don't tell me. How are you, pal? I see, I see you're enjoying your singles career. I see ever since I was told I could never wrestle again, you've enjoyed your singles career! What this is you about. are living my dream. Are you well, shitting me? JJ, when I got hurt, when I was in the hospital, where were you? You know who was there? My best friend, not you. Shoot, shall I? So, shoot, tell them how it is. Damn. This is the way it's going. Damn, JJ. Next show in August, you versus me for the Reading Invasion Championship in a Canadian rules match. Hold up, hold up, take care of him, man, take care of him, get rid of him, object him.
ladies and gentlemen, that is it for here in Reading and Reading Invasion Pro Wrestling. I don't have words. I'm I'm as shocked as you are. I don't I don't know what the hell just happened. But I can promise I'm gonna get to the bottom of it. Leave the fellow thinks this is his Reading Invasion Pro, but he's dead wrong. This is my Reading Invasion Pro. This is our Reading Invasion Pro, and that shit does not fly. <laughs>